Alright, back in Portal 2 today, covering Chapter 8, The Itch. I mean, it's two main achievements in this uh, that we have to go out of our way to get. Smash TV and You Made Your Point, and I'll be showing how to get both. Along with uh, beating all the various test chambers. Just waiting for everything to load up. Alright. We're back into the um, modern day part of Aperture Science. For God's sake, back from boxes. our foray it's into. Uh, it's literally your only purpose. Walking onto but How can you. Alright, do portal down through the vent. The one on the wall. Warmer. Warmer. Boiling hot. Okay, Alright, so it seems that, uh... You're very cold. Very, very, very cold. Look, just get on the bus! He's, um... Designed new boxes oh, that are half a robot. Oh, funny, because we've been in this for 12 hours, and you haven't solved it either, so I know why you're laughing. You've mm -hmm. got one hour! Solve it! He's getting pissed. <laughs> and it's, uh... Wheatley's incompetence has been, apparently, uh... Taking a toll on the facility. And things are starting to fall apart, as you can hear from the uh, explosions around us. Stupid. Uh, false. Look at the false. Explosion imminent. Evacuate the facility immediately. Before I fix that, one uh. reactor core is at critical. Yeah, fixed. Hey, it is oh. great seeing you guys again. Seriously, um, it turns out I'm a little bit short on test subjects right now, so this works out perfect. And off we go. Okay. <laughs> You have no idea what it's like in this body. I have to test all the time, or I get this this itch. You know, it must be hardwired into the system or something. Uh, explaining oh, some well, of uh, you, when I do test, why Gladys oh, was the way she was. Alive. Nothing feels better. It's just uh, that's why I've got to test. That's why I've got to test. So you're gonna test, and I'm gonna watch. And everything is gonna be just fine. Core mm. overheating. Nuclear. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I think so too, Gladys. Alright. Design this test myself. It's a little bit difficult. You'll notice the moat area there. Very deadly. Extremely dangerous. Eventually. It's, yeah, not at the moment, but we, I'm working on it. Still working on it. Alright, so the first achievement is you made your point, and uh, we just basically have to do absolutely nothing and stand still for like 60 um, seconds. As it is to imagine, there actually is a solution. Devilishly hidden. Yeah, bite me. <laughs> I'll give you a hint. Button. That's all I'm gonna say. One word. Button. Nope. Not doing it. Do 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 do. All right, we unlocked it. Refuse to solve the first test in chapter eight. And uh, he gets mad, or if uh, oh, we wait yes. to solve it even more, and he'll start oh, yelling. Well but done. I'm not gonna wait all around oh, just for that, because it's not anything spectacular. Oh, that felt really good. Oh, here's an idea. Since making tests is so difficult, why don't you just keep solving this test? Same like, one, and I can uh, just like watch you solve it. Yeah, all right. that, that sounds much easier. <laughs> this is ridiculous. And nothing. All right, can't blame me for trying. Okay, new tests, new tests. Got uh -huh. tests around here somewhere. And now we got dual pit experiment. We don't have to go out of our way for this one. That just oh, you have you to get that basically. All right. <laughs> uh, 
crazy. As you can see, uh, it's now Wheatley Laboratories. <laughs> Alright, now we're gonna start the Smash TV achievements, um, our achievement. There's several of these TV panels that we have to destroy. Um, created by, uh, Wheatley here. Alright, um... Here's how we're gonna do this. Let's grab our box buddy. Oops. Uh. All right. Well, he's where I want him to be, anyways. <laughs> I think. Uh, no. No, I need him to come back. Uh. All right. Hold on. Actually, no. Wait. Let me do this. All right. And fire an orange portal up here. Alright, that's gonna get him up against the wall there. And aim our orange portal up there. Oh, ah, nice, hit it. Alright, that's the first television of uh, many. Alright. Uh, let's get this little sucker on this thing. And this solves the test for us. Well done. Seriously, both of you. Why don't, I, why don't you two go on ahead, yeah? I'll just, I'll catch up with you. Alright. Okay, so the bad news is the tests are my test now. So huh. they can kill us. The good news is, well, none so far, to be honest. I'll get back to you on that. Oh, thanks, Gladys. <laughs> so well with her tests, so... Uh. Alright, test yeah. chamber two. Test and we got another TV tests. to smash. Line around. Jammed them all together. Buttons, got funnels, bottomless pits are involved. It's got it all. It's got it all. Absolute dynamite. Alright. This one is a bit tricky. If I remember correctly. Okay, I needed to get a good idea of where I was going there. Alright. Alright, okay, this is taking too long, okay? I'll just tell you how to solve the test, okay? I Step need to get up there. Alright. Never mind. Never mind. Solve it yourself. You need to get this cube onto this beam. And then kind of uh, send it up against the wall the same way we did uh, with the eyes. Except. I'm going to put an orange portal here. Oh! And he flew through down it and then hit the TV, and that's number two. So you're just helping me, really, by smashing them? Alright. Open your orange portal through here again. Okay. Now we're gonna get another box and this time we're gonna use it for the button. Alright. Come to me. There we go. Well done. Thanks. All we had to do was pull that lever. What? Well, no, 
<laughs> she tricked Wheatley, that's great. Uh. Alright, now we're on a test chamber number three. And another monitor here. I found a sealed off wing, hundreds, hundreds of perfectly good test chambers, just sitting there, filled with skeletons, shook them out, good as new. Huh. Skeletons. Right, I guess I did stockpile some tests. Just as momentous, though. And, there we go. see if we can get this. You can't even tell, can you? Seamless. There's another way to do it, but... Oh, almost got it. Oops. Alright, one more time. Ah, oh, almost did that, but we got this in the way. Okay, so we're gonna have to do it another way. Ah, oh, I was being a little bit facetious about that, wanting to get rid of monitors thing. Okay. They're actually really quite useful. So, I didn't <laughs> so um, if you could just avoid smashing them. Kiss my ass. Alright. Onwards. Now we're going to go across the uh, gap here by using the portal to um, move this teleporter beam thing. And uh, as you can see, it's going to be guys uh, falling from this thing. Okay, we're going to place our blue portal there so that this uh, beam is right underneath where the boxes fall from. And then move it to this panel. Collect our box. Fire our blue portal against the wall there. Get on the faith plate with our box and safely back on the other side. Alright, and the button. Okay. I don't remember how to do this. Ah, okay. Alright. Up, oh, a little bit too high. Move it down a little bit. There we go. Uh, okay. So, forgot we needed to be up here first. Let's grab our box again. This guy's gonna move around though, so we need to kinda put him on his back. There we go. We're good now. Now I can't move around. Alright. There we go. And an orange portal on that uh, central patch right there. Here we go. Here it comes. And we're good. Oh, disappointed. Oh no, it's happening sooner than I expected. Uh oh, what is happening? <laughs> uh, I don't think so. Anyways, um. Okay, now we're on to the next test chamber and another video. I think this is a pretty much like a video panel in each chamber and two and. The fifth one. Okay. 
Alright. Alright, test chamber four. Apparently being civil isn't motivating you. So let's well let's try her way, alright? Fatty. Adopted fatty. Fatty fatty no parents. What? I'll watch out for a second. What's wrong with being adopted? well. Um lack of parents. And also nothing. But some of my best friends actually are orphans. But <laughs> Gladys is standing up for us now, it's kind of cool. Seems like uh, her opinion of us has slightly changed, perhaps. Alright, so we're gonna grab this turret, that's what I was doing before, and we bring it next to the TV panel, and it will shoot it for us, and we can just drop him and get rid of him. You, what have you done? You've proven that you can break screens. It's proven. Well done. Factual. All right. Well done. Good. Aren't you? So Miss we can smash. change the direction of this thing with the the button here. What we're gonna do is pull that box over to this side, and then place our orange portal right there and then we've brought the box over here move a portal out of the way put our box down on the button fire our portal so that it's picking up us only and not uh, a little friend and now we're on the other side nice and safe and we just need to get up here I gotta remember this correctly I gotta recall how I <laughs> always forget this stuff like right after I've done it. Maybe like ah, alright, I remember now. <laughs> Ridiculous. Anyways. Um okay. Alright, yeah, we just need to get the box off the button now. Now we can move ourselves up here. Uh, Alright, we're good. <laughs> okay, this next test chamber is going to be number five, where there's going to be uh, two TVs for us to smash. That's chamber five here. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. I hope, that, I hope that didn't disturb you too much then. It was the sound of books. Pages being turned. So that's just what I was doing. Just reading uh, books. So not a moral. Anyway, just finish the last one. Just now the hardest one. Machiavelli. Do not know what all the fuss was about. Understood it perfectly. Have you read that one? Oh, nice. Yeah, stacked it. Well, on with the test. Wish there was more books. Well, there's not. Alright, we're going to use a faith plate to launch ourselves into the middle here. We've got our blue portal beneath us, and our orange portal is uh, moving that um, beam. So we're going to fire our orange portal over the side, and the fall projects us over to this side here. Alright. Um, we're going to reset up the portal the same way uh, it was when we came over for this box. And um, in the same sense, we're just going to do exactly the same thing, move our blue portal here. Oops. Ah, I messed that up. Let me try this again. Alright. <laughs> Alright, we moved our orange portal. Alright, it's at the ceiling again. Bam. And... Oh, nice hit. Alright. So we broke this screen. And uh, there's another screen over there we have to break. Okay, I forgot to do that one too. Alright, so we're gonna dissolve our cube, buddy. Alright, 
And you're gonna aim for this spot right about here. Where these lines make it cross. And that should hit it. Yeah, got it. Test subjects in Africa who don't even have monitors in their test chambers. All right. All right. What do you think about that? Before you break any more of them, yeah. Mm, that's right. All right. So now we're gonna send for another cube. This time, uh, we're gonna keep it. Should have done the uh, other cube first, but or the other monitor first, but whatever. This is takes slightly longer. All right. I got a cube. I'm gonna place on the button. Like drugs. <laughs> All right, so we got both TVs in chamber five, and now we're on to chamber six, and there's back to one on the in each. Just moving the old test chamber a little bit closer to me, um, out of thought, maybe proximity to the test solving might give us stronger results. What was that? Maybe we just need to jump on the face plate. Is it a hobby for you now? I mean, honestly, it's, you know, it's crazy. I mean, I mean, you must have been running around for hours. I'm surprised you've got the energy to smash screens willy-nilly. Honestly, I'd, I'd have a little lie down for you. Have a nap. Alright. <laughs> kind of made him shut up there. All right, we're gonna use this hard light bridge to stop the uh, faith plate the second time we use it. All right. I think I forgot to press the button for a box. <laughs> All right. There we go. Ah, that's right. We need to block the box. Using this bridge. Alright, now it's down by those turrets. No, uh, you know what? Because of where it is, we don't even really need to mess with uh if you if it lands like right directly in the turrets, you can put the bridge down and use that. But we don't need to. Alright, I right, the box that I needed. Jump back up here. Put our hard light bridge back down there to block the turrets. Oh, I didn't quite do it that well. There we go. Are you, right. are you absolutely sure you're solving these correctly? I mean, yes, you solved it, but I'm wondering. Mm, now if we're back. Maybe there's a number of ways to solve them, and you're picking all the worst. And then use the hard light bridge one no, more time. No, and we're up here what now. Ta da! Okay, on to next test chamber. We're gonna skip a few numbers, and we're gonna go straight to number 11. There is no 7 through. Ten. I guess uh, Wheatley is getting unsatisfied with uh, quality of test chambers. This is not good. Huh. Have a brainwave. I'm gonna take See, you test chamber eleven now. And then watch ten at once. Get a more sort of concentrated burst of science. Oh, on a related right. note, I am gonna need you to solve these ten times as fast. Anyway, uh, just give me a wave, would you, before There's we a monitor. Story. I don't want to spoil the ending for when I watch it later. Alright. Use the portal here. Portal here. And using the teleporter beam to send us up into the air. And once we've reached the top, we're going to fire our blue portal on that uh, marker there and that allows us to reach this area and grab this cube and right, take this cube down here with us and we use it to block this beam alright 
Alright, come back through. And we're gonna use this faith plate to launch us uh, across this gap, which is no longer blocked by that beam. Because before, um, you would not be able to uh, get across it. The beam would end up blocking us. Okay. Place our orange portal here. Come back through. Let's pull this box out of the way. And as you can see, we can see Wheatley on the monitor through this portal. And we're going to aim. Oh. We need to portal a little bit higher. There we go. Now, if I'm honest, to wonder if you're doing all this stream breaking on purpose. I just, I'm beginning to actually take it personally. You know what I mean? Like it's like a, it's like an insult to me. Ow. Okay. Place this cube there. That's gonna lower uh, one of the panels for us, but we got to uh, step through first. Oh. Don't want this guy moving. I have a feeling he might if I just leave him like that. There we go. That should keep him from moving at all. Alright. Put the laser through so it's hitting this location. And we can move that. Move it there. Actually, we want to move it way out of the way, so... Oh, there you go. Now this um, beam thing is back online at a teleporter teleportation tunnel I believe is what it's called alright and that brings this thing down and we can move the blue portal out of the way and it sends us up there we go Whitley is not a good caretaker. Apparently, is the point. <laughs> All right. We are now on to test chamber twelve. Was was self-destructing already fixed. Programmed in one last tremor for all time's sake. Two, I like okay. one or two more tremors in there just for fun. Morning. Core overheating. I let him keep his job. I'm not a monster. Ignore what he's saying. Just now, keep in mind these two um, little sections that have uh, four squares around them on either side. Um, those are where we're going to fire our portals to hit these two locations here. The orange one, uh, lower one, will make the um, panels here move the way we need them to. Alright. Now you can step through and onto these pads. And um, this one up here will hit this one, uh, receiver, and that'll turn off these red lasers. And I'll show you how this works. Right, this requires good timing. There you go. Get on the other side, and we can reactivate it. That allows us to keep going. And you can place the orange one there, uh, just for now. And, uh, okay. Now that we're down here by the button, we need to place the orange portal back to the moving receiver. And this will send our platform over to the left. Uh, or away.
away from us. Oh, we're a little bit too close to me there. Alright, we push this button. Uh, is it up there still? Yep, okay, we have the optical cube now on our platform. Alright, now we need to get across. Oops, wrong one. Alright, here we go. Okay. And jump up here. Now I've got our optical cube and we're on the platform. Alright, let's get ready to move. Oh! Alright. That was close. Deactivate the uh, laser grid here. And uh, re reactivate everything. Alright, let's stop it from moving now. And this is how we're going to get the next TV. Redirect the laser first to oh, Wheatley. There we go. And then uh, now you can hit the uh, receiver to open the door. Alright. Okay. Oh, we gotta move it. All right, still Let's keep there moving. we go. Sorry about the lift. It's out of service because it melted. Got it back. All right. Oh, well, look at this. <laughs> Might as well, you know, give you the tour. Um, to your left. Uh, we're gonna take this tunnel here. Of some kind. Don't know what they do. Um, but very science. Right. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh God, run! I'm not supposed to be there. Ha! Shit. Idiot. <laughs> yes, Gladys, let's kill Wheatley. <laughs> Guy's a dick. Alright, there's nothing really there, so just make your way past. I'm gonna jump past the uh, little gap there. <laughs> All right, test chamber 15. Yeah, just, uh, we skipped a few uh, numbers again. For you, obviously. Who else would I be doing it for? No one. So let's see here. Exit, exit, exit. There is no All right. exit. We're no, gonna I'll hit. Just, I'll make an exit for your test. All right. Let's try this again. While he's busy with that, I'm gonna try to propel myself. I thought I had lost you when poking around for other test subjects. No luck there. Everyone's still dead. Oh, I did find something though. Reminds me. I've got oh. a big surprise for you two. Seriously, look forward to it. Okay. Let's try this one more time. Uh oh, let me move this a little bit up. There's another way to do this, but I'm gonna try uh the projection or project Projecting myself method first. <laughs> oh, almost did it. Whatever. Okay, let's just focus on uh, doing this the other way. Okay. Alright, so this is gonna turn that on. And then this will drop. Uh, do our box here. How we're gonna collect the box? Let's fire a blue portal here and an orange portal here, and that'll push the box. And we use our orange portal there, and the box falls and starts to go towards us. Hey. All right. Now, my good sir. Oh no. Okay. Now, this is what we're gonna 
do. Got our orange portal here. Sending up our crate. And pop our blue portal there. It should fall through just and smash the TV. I've got hordes of replacement monitors just lying around back here. In the old warehouse, so I can just wheel out and fall back on. There's only one left. I've ordered loads of spare monitors thinking some crazy woman's going to go out and smash them all. Sorry if that's my fault. Sorry if I didn't have the forethought to think, oh, she, she might go crazy with <laughs> me and just smash all the monitors instead of just getting on with things. Yeah, sorry I didn't think of that. Alright, um... Next, we have to stay on the pad. We've got our little cube thing. That's kind of keeping the orange uh, speed gel flowing here. And we're just going to have enough of it get in the uh, teleporter tunnel so that we can kind of like cover the area there. We can actually do this. We don't really need that orange stuff anymore. Alright. Well, we can just take our uh, teleporter tunnel the first time. But we're gonna have to come back. Alright, so orange portal is the exit portal for the tunnel. Funnel here. Alright. So we're gonna have to come through here. Let's zoom in. We've placed our orange uh, portal here. Yeah, that's right where we're gonna need it to be. And I come in. And, uh,. Orange portal's over here, blue portal's here. Okay, yeah. So we're gonna move our blue portal right there. And now we've got the teleporter funnel that'll send us to the uh, exit. And now we run. Oh, there we go. And it worked. There we go. You're going to love it. And we unlock the achievement tunnel of funnel, which is master the excursion funnel. Okay, that's what they're called, excursion funnels. Love it. Until you didn't click your do you did. <laughs> Alright, I Very solo. Uh, Jackass. You're, uh, you're picking up on what I'm saying there, but. Yes, thanks, we get it. I think this is going to be our last chamber as well. Alright, whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Alright, so use the, uh... Only three more chambers to your big surprise. <laughs> conversion gel to, uh... <laughs> Put all the way across. Alright, as you can see here, we've got another button to um, mitigate the flow. Alright. Oh, I'm gonna watch out for those turrets right now. Okay. Um. Actually, we don't need to use this thing yet. Alright, let's teleport ourselves over here. Oops. Alright. We need the orange one. Alright. Send some of this uh, repulsion gel. We'll drop it. And then send some more. And jump into the f excursion funnel. We're just ahead of our gel here. 
I'm gonna jump out of the excursion funnel and then step on the pad here and it's gonna start pulling it back in. And we're gonna save it at this point because it's a good idea to um, excuse me it's a little bit tricky it's not that bad. Okay so we're waiting for our uh, gel here to be pulled back in. And if it starts to get close you can Go back and forth there. We don't want to lose any of it though. Alright. And. Oh, wait. I almost messed that up. Okay. This requires precise timing. Alright. Oh, got it. Alright. So, to kind of explain exactly what I did, you gotta aim the repulsion gel until it's right above the first turret. And then when it falls, it should hit these two turrets that you saw bounced away, and leaving this one third turret. And now... Charge! Oh, crap! Ow, ow! Ah, that didn't work. Alright, oh, I'm gonna try again. Oh, I did it wrong. Do. Alright, so, good idea again, save at this point, um, alright, trying to time this here, Ooh. pull through, and now, okay, so what we want to do is we're going to wait for the Propulsion gel to be just over that first turret and ah, fire our portal and it should fall on those two turrets, leaving us this third turret here. Alright. And um, next, how we're gonna do this is we're gonna move the portal to the side there. And in that way, the beam does not come through. We set ourselves on the opposite side there. And uh, move our blue portal right there. And then our orange portal here. And that'll send us through. Oh, and you gotta land on the non-repulsive gel area and then pick up the turret really quickly. set him down and he got Wheatley and we just unlocked Smash TV all right huh. that was complex okay so now the idea here ourselves up against the ceiling and fire our blue portal on that uh, ledge thing. We should hit the repulsive gel and we launch ourselves through. This is the end of chapter 8. Chapter 9 doesn't really announce itself like the previous ones do. I'll bet you're both dying to know what your big surprise is. Well, only two more chambers. Yeah, that's the end of uh, chapter 8. And then onwards to chapter 9.